Paulette Gabera Farah was a four-year-old Mexican girl who went missing from her home on March 22, 2010. Paulette's parents immediately notified the authorities as well as campaigned for their daughter's return through the media and social networks. Paulette's room was searched thoroughly by many different agencies, including the use of search and rescue dogs. Afterwards, her room was used by her mother to conduct interviews with the media. Paulette's body was found on March 31st, 2010, nine days after she went missing. But where she was found has haunted the true crime community. It just does not sit right with anybody. Her body was actually found underneath her mattress, wrapped in a blanket at the foot of her bed. Right here where this blanket is, is where her body was found wrapped in a blanket. The only reason why her body was discovered was due to the smell of her body decomposing. However, Paulette's death was ruled accidental due to the evidence pointing towards the child accidentally asphyxiating herself. Many, many people are suspicious about this. It just really doesn't line up that her room was searched. Her nanny even told a blog, I looked in the bathroom under the bed and in the closet. I saw that she was not there and I also went into the bedroom of the lady to look for her. She also looked in Paulette's sister's bedroom. Then she said she went back and looked again in Paulette's bedroom. So if Paulette had been there the whole time, why had investigators not found her body sooner? Also, very oddly, Paulette's mother's friend was allowed to live in their home for several days immediately following Paulette's disappearance and this friend actually slept in Paulette's room which was not secured by police at the time. In the time that she spent in the house, the bed was made on a daily basis and nobody noticed Paulette's body or bloody stains on the sheets as they appeared on a forensic video. This woman slept in Paulette's bed and while she was there, the bed was made up several times and still no one discovered Paulette's body. There is a video of Paulette's body being discovered and there's controversy about this video. People think it might've actually been staged by the Mexican police. At one point in the video, one of the officers says that Paulette was severely beaten to death and a few moments after the forensic expert at his right removes the bed's blanket to reveal two large blood stains. One of them as big as an adult's head. Then this same man walks to the front of the bed and with the help of another forensic expert removes all of the sheets to reveal Paulette's corpse partially hidden on one side of the mattress. In May 2017, Paulette's body was exhumed and cremated. They said that her remains were no longer considered evidence for the investigation, and so her case is officially closed. Her death is officially ruled an accident, and since investigators botched the investigation, we may never truly know what happened to Paulette. So let me know what you think. Do you think that this poor child accidentally strangled herself, or do you think she was killed? Do you think perhaps there was a cover-up in her death?